Hi guys, uh, thanks for joining me. I stopped at uh, Home Goods TJ Maxx to check out what there is for Valentine's Day and Easter and St. Patrick's Day. So there was some new Valentine's stuff that, that I took a look at. Um, those Ray Dead ornaments were cute. And I love gnomes, and I'm, they always have these little coupled gnomes. That one's $12.99. That is so adorable. And this is really pretty. I just love the embellishments on it. And those are coasters, I think, for $12.99. This was at the table right at the front of the store when you walk in. Uh, just some different stuff that I hadn't seen before. I have um, the Halloween version of those gnomes. So they're $14.99. And I just have them hanging up all the time <laughs> at work. <laughs> this rainbow gnome I think is super adorable. I hadn't seen it before. <clears throat> and, you know, it's weighted on the bottom so it doesn't topple over. And I thought this, um, I don't know, $50, $49. it's $49.99, but um, I had never seen this, this kind, this brand before. It's a special brand, I guess, since it's a lot more expensive than the other ones. And I love this little gnome platter serving tray thing. It's breakable, but I think it's really cute with the different conversation hearts. And they also had um, some summery type stuff. These are Ray Dunn hand towels, um, two pack for, I think it was $12.99. The pineapple ones, seashells and sea stars. I, I like the, the teal color. I think it's pretty. And then this um, long pillow for St. Patrick's Day, May the Road Rise Up to Meet You, which is a, I think an Irish proverb or something like that. Um, they had some really cute Easter pillows. This one's $19.99. It seemed like they had more Easter stuff than they did St. Patrick's stuff. Um, I guess Easter is probably a larger holiday than the St. Patrick's Day. I thought this one was cute because it has the little cotton tails on it, which is adorable. And these are like little peeps with the tails. And it's $24.99. We had some St. Patrick's Day blankets. And they're, you know, the normal $16.99 price. But most blankets are. There's no one. But, I mean, I can't have so many blankets. There's too many. This cute Easter one. I love the bunnies, like, butts hanging out of the planter. Really adorable. So here's some St. Patrick's Day pillows. This is one of the beaded ones. <laughs> I thought this was cute, but I couldn't pull it out. They have quite a few Tommy Bahama things. Um, the regular price on these were like near $80 for one pillow. Um, of course, the home goods price is way more affordable um, than $80. And they had a few different ones. There's a toucan with the pretty sunset. It seemed like they were all the same price. So, those were all Tommy Bahama, and then they have these uh, lemons are in, in uh, style this season, I think, or this coming season. They have quite a few different lemon things. There's some picnic blankets. Uh, I always have one in the back of my car. Mine's from Halloween. I haven't used it yet, but I have it just in case. And I thought this was a little pricey. Um, it's cushions, I guess, but Tommy Bahama, you know, it's a popular brand with, with uh, some people. And then these cute little St. Patrick's Day characters, $16.99, I think. That one looks like it's from the Wizard of Oz to me. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I think they're cute. I know that they're a little creepy looking too, but 
I have a few myself. Not St. Patrick's Day. I haven't found one that I like for St. Patrick's Day. And there's this felted garland. I think it's cute. It's uh, $14.99. Hmm. Gnomes on a rainbow. How adorable, right? Of course, there's always a bunch of different gnomes and stuff. So that's a, a two two gnomes together for fourteen ninety nine. That's you know, a really good deal, I think. This is a wooden um, shamrock clover. I'm not sure which, but it's pretty heavy. Here's some Easter baskets. They had quite the variety. I think some are supposed to be for decoration. Others, you know, you can use for your kids for Easter baskets. I've always, um, whenever my kids were younger, I would do just regular Easter baskets. But as, as they got a little older, I did different things. I loved this tablecloth. I think it's so cute. I don't know why. Because it's gnomes, probably. I didn't buy it though, because I don't really need a St. Patrick's Day tablecloth. <laughs> um, I really think that these foam flowers are so beautiful. They have wreaths, which is what these are. And then they also have like stick flowers, like long, uh, tall. You'll see those a little while later in the video. Spring gnome, how pretty the colors are. They had some really cute Easter stuff. I really like this this bunny. Thought it was adorable, and then this one is like uh, that pot metal, I think. Of course, Easter gnomes, fourteen ninety nine. Most of the gnomes are always such a great price here. This lot, this egg lights up. It's really pretty, um, and it sparkles just spinning it in the, in the light that was in the store. We have some long leg gnomes, and I think this this was really pretty. It's a wooden, and it reminds me of like chocolate eggs. And then this was cement. It was really heavy. <laughs> oh, pretty Easter eggs. I don't know what people are gonna do for dying eggs this year because eggs are so expensive. So. Um, I know Michael's has like paper eggs or wooden eggs. Might want to pick those up before they disappear. They had a cute little Easter display and this bunny is so adorable. And these little houses light so up, $12.99. And they have the bigger versions. I'll show you in a minute. I couldn't see the price on the bigger versions because I'm not picking it up. It's really heavy and huge. And unfortunately, they didn't have it priced. I thought this little straw piggy was super cute. And they have that large gnome and egg display. I think it was around $80. So there's the two big houses that they have. They do light up, but um, like I said, I couldn't see the price. But I love them. They're like the Christmas ones, only Easter. And I just think they're so adorable. With all the embellishments and the color and the sparkle. I love it, but I have no idea how much they are. Sorry. <laughs> and I thought she was really pretty. She has a velvet little little dress on. And these cute little Easter gnomes, like the yarn kind. And this big egg display that could be indoor or outdoor. And that's the same as the gnome one that they have. A little couple of bunny rabbits. So cute. More Easter baskets. Oh, look at the dinosaur one. No wooden rabbits and carrots. Cute. I like this little understated, like kind of abstract wooden bunny. These wreaths are really, really pretty. Um, there's a smaller version as well that we'll see in a minute. And then here's some garland like the St. Patrick's Day, but Easter. It's um, felt, $14.99 also. 
<laughs> and no minicar. Come on. Who doesn't want that? <laughs> it's so cute. They had these purple gnomes that their the colors were slightly different. And the reason I recorded this is because it looks like a ducky to me. Like just it's so cute. Like a ducky or a chicky or Easter. And it was really soft as well. I thought she was beautiful. The roses on her head are f uh, foam, but I don't know. Seven ninety nine. Look at that face. And then <laughs> a fairy gnome or a butterfly gnome. So adorable. Fourteen ninety nine. I'm not sure on the color of these. This is <laughs> it's like the only dark colored thing I think. Fourteen ninety nine. It's more like nautical eggs than like Easter eggs version. And there's the smaller version of the wreath, which I think is so pretty, $16.99. I think this one was cute too, a duck with the chick on the head, $14.99. And here's some lemon stuff, um, just an end cap display. Like I said, uh, lemons are in. These are only $9.99, these mug sets. I don't just think that's a great deal. You get four mugs in this just little stand, and they had different ones with bees and sayings and be kind. I don't know if this is for Mother's Day or spring or what, but it says home is where the mom is. It's Ray Dunn. Home is where mom is. They have Wizard of Oz Ray Dunn, a variety of those. And um, St. Patrick's Day mugs with some different things. The Yellow Brick Road. Oh, the Yellow Brick Road. I don't know. They're so cute. Ray Dunn has uh, <laughs> just so many different cute mugs and canisters. And, you know, I think they're different, different ones, different places. And then I see all these. They have name mugs. Now, they'll never have my name, and if they do, it won't be spelled right. But if you have a common name and you want a mug with your name on it that's already made, I'd take a look at your Home Goods or TJ Maxx or um, one of their stores to see whether or not you can find a mug with your name on it. Irish and proud. That's no place like home canister. So cute with the Wicked Witch's legs. <laughs> Honey bunny. Fairest of them all. Snow White. They have more bee stuff. I think bees are, are in as well. I'm not sure where the price is inside that mug. Happy St. Patty's. Redone also. Oh, I thought this was cute. Cottontail cutie. <laughs> $9.99. I like the bunny on top, but Cottontail cutie is just adorable. I mean, look at all these St. Patrick's Day things. They have a display um, table with St. Patrick's Day stuff. And those, so these little trees, there's Easter versions and St. Patrick's versions. And, um,. I think that I've seen a Valentine version too, so rather than just having them for Christmas, I guess they're making them for all the holidays because, you know, people are doing trees. Like, I have a Valentine's Day tree that I'll be switching to St. Patrick's Day and then Easter because it's just a little white mini tree. So they're, I guess, jumping on that, which is smart. There's just so many different Ray Dunn mugs. Here's St. Patrick's Day rain done hand towels, $12.99 as well. <clears throat> Those yarn gnomes, really cute. And they have some of the little fairies or elves. I thought this ladybug gnome was really cute. So they, they're starting to get some spring stuff. You know, so some yard decorations and that kind of thing. This was really cool. I mean, it's it like rotates around. I love these metal decorations for outside. They had a 
flamingo version of that same style. Different. Look at the sea turtle. How cute. This lights up. This giraffe is ginormous, taller than I am. And it's pretty, and look at those eyelashes. It's so adorable. Here's the Easter version of the those little light up trees. They had three different colors there. And these coasters are cute. They're gnomes, of course. That's why they caught my attention. Look at those, so cute. I thought this I, this uh, rabbit looked like it was like a chocolate rabbit wrapped in foil. So I thought I liked that. A lot of different eggs. I don't know if they're for decoration or for Easter egg hunts or what. But regular eggs are so pricey. I don't know if people are going to be dyeing them much. Which is sad. My kids always love dyeing Easter eggs. Here's more of the names on the mugs. All just female names. Here's those uh, flowers that they have on the wreaths. They have longer, they have long stems. That's $14.99 and you get three, it looks like. They're so pretty. And they're, they're pretty lightweight, they're foam. Here's some St. Patrick's Day towels. <laughs> That's cute. They all seem to be pretty much the same price. So then I found some more Tommy Bahama stuff. So this is the end of my shopping trip there at the Home Goods TJ Maxx. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Is there anything that you saw that you um, want to get or that you really liked? like and subscribe and i appreciate you watching i will see you next time bye